I knew there was pain on his face. Um, like his eyes, you know. He always had, he had like the, the sweetest eyes, you know, and they were always like really gleamy. And I don't know, he just, uh, they, 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 they clenched, like his eyes tightened, like in so much pain when he, I remember that one specific scream. Okay, when I say scream, he he didn't scream like how we scream. Like he wasn't able to have sound come out of his mouth. But his mouth like opened like so wide and he just threw his head back, you know. And it looked like it was like the most pain he had ever experienced before. And I it, it was so frightening and it hurt so bad to even witness that I ran outside of the hospital room and I had never cried in front of him at that point I was trying really hard to stay strong for him so I rushed out and I just lost it let go of that hug and I looked up and right when I looked up that was like the last second and he had like flatlined right after that and then my mom like said in like the most like you could tell she it was just like part of her died too and she said nope that's it he's gone <sighs> This is Wendy. I'm unavailable to take your call. Please leave a message and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you.
and have a great I just need to walk outside right now and think about it for a while. I'll be fine. I just need to be alone for a little while. Okay. Love you. I will. Bye. You said you loved me. You said you'd never leave. What's the darkest roast you have? A French roast. Could I please have a regular size of that? I live and work around here, so, you know, I've been in a lot lately. Just a lot going on. God, I don't know why I'm telling you this. It, 
It's okay. It happens to all of us. Anyway, have a good evening. Lost. Did I lose you? I can feel you. Feel us. Together. Did you feel the same? a doctor on each side of him. I, I just said, uh, like, you're gonna be fine. You know, I couldn't think of what to say, like, what, like, what do you say, you know? And you're like, okay, I have a few seconds left. And, you know, you can... Well, you can spend like your whole life, you know, like contemplating what you'll say to somebody if it's the last thing, if you think it's the last thing you're ever going to say to them. You could think of all these profound things. And it does it's weird that it doesn't go like that, you know, because like the most basic thing will come out of your mouth. And it's like the most, you know, it's, it seems like it's the most childlike thing that you could possibly say. Like, you'll be okay, or it'll all be fine. And it seems like so mundane. <laughs>